Hey mates, welcome to Tech Solutions. Do you want to install Wine Stable on your Peppermint 12? Peppermint 12 based on Debian 11 Bullseye has just been released. It's different and more stable from Peppermint 10 which was based on Ubuntu. Let's see how to install Wine on Peppermint 12 in easy and working steps. Let's begin with opening terminal on Peppermint. It's always a good idea to update your Linux before installing anything on it. Done doing that? You must be seeing we are Peppermint 12 which is based on Debian 11 Bullseye. As a step 1 you need to download the Wine HQGPG key on your Linux. This can be done with the shown command on your screens. The key can be downloaded quickly and will be saved as winehq.key file on your Linux. Now we need to add it to our peppermint. This can be done with the shown command. Done adding the key? Now we will add the Wine HQ official repository for Debian 11 Bullseye on our Peppermint 12 Linux. This will be saved as winehq.list file in the temp folder. Now copy the file from temp folder into sources.list.d folder on your peppermint using cp command. Now you can delete the file from temp folder. Run apt update once again to update the newly added sources. You can now install Wine Stable on your Peppermint 12 using the shown on screen command. At the time of making the video Wine 7 is the most recent and stable version of Wine. This may take a while to download and install Wine on your Linux OS. Please have patience during this and do not exit or close the terminal until the installation is not finished. It's done. Wine is installed successfully. You can verify it through Wine version command. You can also open Wine configuration window using Wine CFG command. During this you might be asked to install Wine Mono installer on your Linux. Install it. This is required for Wine to run certain Microsoft Windows applications. Wine is there for you. You can start using it. Let's run sample wine clock application. It's working fine. Anything to ask? Comment it. Thanks for watching. Good day.